and we're underway here under sunshine and cloudless skies. And the opening kick goes out of bounds and a flag on the first touch of the day. Or this week. Lazaro will get a pitch from Ward going up top. Look at this, and he's got his man. It's Chedras. Flags on the play, but a big strike here for the Chippewas on the first play from scrimmage. And five. Again through the air, Lazaro's good to Ward. It's going to be short of the first down marker. Gain of three is. I watch you. And look here, Central Michigan is on the board, cashing in on their first possession. It all started with the big 35-yard strike to Childress. So try third down again. Lewerke to throw, and there's contact tipped and almost intercepted. Boy, they had Felton Davis bottled up. Sean Bunting on the initial coverage for the Chippewas. And Swain, who's Jamison out due to suspension and an injury to McCoy, almost had himself his first interception of the season here. And then Bryce Berenger, who we may see later, is the brand new dude guy. <laughs> Both guys walked on. Hunt last year, Berenger during the bye week this year. So there's that football. And against the nation's number one rush defense, a gain of two. Boy, they have really bottled up opposing running backs, quarterbacks, doesn't matter. The team bus, Michigan State's ability to stop you on the ground has been off his foot here on fourth down. Like fielding a ground or a short hop in baseball, and he just does hang on. White's able to cover it up. He remains in on second and short. And on the option, it is given to him. Bounces outside. Room to run. All the way inside the 10-yard line. Two carries now for Jefferson. And Reed may have made a touchdown-saving tackle on a gain of 15 by Ladarius Jefferson. Looking for the end zone. Intercepted in the end zone by Bunting. And another stop for the Chippewas. A big table takeaway there. That's the first pick for Sean Bunting this season. The Chippewas will hold a 3-0 lead and have it back here in the first quarter. when we They are 0-2 for 2 on third down thus far, but lead it by three. Lazaro, the throw, got it underneath. That's caught, and the spot is going to be short of the first down. They're going to make White move a bit, and he will wisely get out of the way. Good bounce here for the visitors from... Mount Pleasant. Moving there, the chips. We're starting position of the day for the Michigan State offense. And off the play action to Hayward. Lewerke to throw. Down the middle. That's cut. And a plenty for a first down. Nice job by Brandon Sowards. Gain of 20 on the throw by Lewerke. Lewerke dumps it off. And it's read perfectly. They stop Ladarius Jefferson, and it's Malik Fountain. When you know it, great tackle by him. Spartans averaging 4.8 yards per play, and Lewerke misses here. On well, his first throw of the second quarter, Taiwan Swain. And Hunt, much like his counterpart on the other side with an Australian-type kick, that'll be fielded at the 12. The season after 48 a year ago. Lazaro looking to throw again. Ball's tipped and intercepted at the 35-yard line. And look who makes good on that penalty. It's David Dowell. First interception for Dowell. 29 yards on the return. And Michigan State will have its best starting spot of the day. That's the second turnover of the game. The first committed by Central Michigan. Well, the pressure on Lazaro led to the overthrow here. And when you're playing safety in the center field, Got to take advantage. Here comes the pitch of the reverse. And a first down on the play. Pardons. We were wanting to see the true freshman nailer today. The working. And the pitch slant. That's caught by White to the 10. And it'll take many Chippewa defenders to bring him down. Cody White's got a first down and then seven to gain of 16 yards. The keep, it's Lewerke. Touchdown, Michigan State. Three-yard carry by Brian Lewerke. He brings home 
his eighth touchdown of the year. Pepsi, and he's going to see, does he crash on the running back here in Jefferson or not? And when he does, that leaves Malik Fountain one-on-one. -on -one. So if you're def defensive coordinator for the Chips, Greg Colby, you're saying, listen, we have a man for a man. The problem is the athletic talent and the speed of Lewerke. Jonathan Ward in the backfield. Rosaro back to work. Steps up. Now scrambling. Wants a block. Got it. And may have a first down on the far side. Tommy Lazaro is starting to stretch his legs a little bit. His confidence is growing. That's a gain of 10. Lazaro looking to go to the air. He's dropped for the first time. Back at the 25-yard line. That's Raekwon Williams. More receivers here for Lazaro. Trying to create something. Dumps it off. And it's read perfectly. Morrissey with a big-time tackle. On the catch by Ja'Cory Sullivan. This one's returnable. Made one miss, but not anybody else. Good punt by Jack Sheldon, and perhaps... Working to look to the air. Pushed out of there by Dana. And he tries to jump past it, but I think he steps on the sideline here. And he's ruled down, and that'll bring up fourth down. Jamie Sabaugh to receive at his own 11. Sabaugh calls for the fair catch. And so the Chippewas get a big stop. And he missed again. That time looking for Childress. Please with Lazaro so far. Third three and out for the visitors. And great field position here for the Spartans. Jaworki with Jefferson protected. Throws wide open, caught. It's right. 15 inside the 10. A leaping catch for Cody White, who had the most reception yards for a true freshman in school history last season. Left of Jaworki here. Third down. Room to run. Dives in the end zone. Touchdown, Michigan State. Second of the day for Jaworki. That one's from five yards out. Third down. Lazaro intercepted. It's Lane. Lane trying to create. Rolls inside the 34-yard line. Justin Lane with his first interception of the season. Four straight incomplete passes. Turns it over in his own territory. Well, a really nice job by... Justin Lane of going up and getting that football. Eyes back on the quarterback the entire time. Plays wide receiver. Nice job on the interception. Working to the short side of the field. To Hayward coming out of the backfield. He is wrapped up and dropped at the 20-yard line. And whistles blow. And we anticipate a timeout here. Unable to play today. Well, working on third down. Pulls it down. Using the legs. And chucked out of bounds at the 10-yard line. Short of the first down marker. Pursuit there by Nathan Brisson fast. Left hash. Lewerke on the hold. Plenty of leg. And Coughlin remains perfect. And Michigan State extends their lead with 29 seconds left in the first half. Mission of the half for Lazaro and the chips. Lazaro's in trouble. And he is crushed. Kenny Willickis with the sack. It's his fourth this season. See him once he learns how to play the end. We're glad to see Lazaro stay in. Going to his right. Almost ran into his own block and award. There's a flag on the play. Probably a hold. Lazaro just trying Lazaro. to get back toward the line of scrimmage. His tackle there by Boyer Randall. It won't be another loss in the play. This time a yard. Well, that'll end the half. Central Michigan kind of sputters to the finish, but they led early 3 to nothing. But the Spartans, at the end of the half, find themselves up by two scores. Off the play fake, Lewerke with his legs again. In the Chippewa territory. First down, Michigan State. They'll flip it. And on the end of the round, it's snuffed out pretty quickly. Welch really had nowhere to go. Minus four on the play. Bunting. Really nice play by Sean Bunting. He recognizes the setup. You saw him there early in the replay. He stepped down and then... 
Second down after the loss. There's Davis. Spins off the man. Dukes another. Almost to the end zone. He's going to be just short. Xavier Crawford made the play to stop him from taking it to the house. 37 yards to Felton Davis. Well, really nice job by Davis. A nice quick out route here. Ball's on time. Makes Crawford miss. He's thinking six. Good effort by Crawford to get him down at the one. First and goal. Hayward. Wrapped up. Dropped in the backfield. Alex Briones. Welch in motion. Take it to him. Give to Hayward. He flips his way in the end zone. Touchdown. Spartans. Second and nine. And Ward just can't go anywhere. Not just today, but really through their first four games to start the season. And carry today. Zaro throws low and incomplete. Intended for Tony Poljan, who was the starting quarterback earlier this season for the Chippewas. A tight end wide receiver. Sowers. Cross midfield, big return inside the 45-yard line. Definitely see your team continue to put up points here in the second half. Off the lateral, Lewerke throws wide open, caught on the far side. And the youngster Nelson not only gets a first down, but a pretty good lick at the end of the play as well. 19 on the game. Michigan State 4-5 of five in the red zone today. And it off, stood up again. And guess who? <laughs> Fountain leading the charge. Well, what's interesting is... Lewerke gives it to Jefferson. Plows into the end zone. Touchdown, Michigan State. And there it is, Ladarius Jefferson's first career touchdown on a two-yard run. Receivers here for Lazaro. And he's got one of the... 31 yard line. That's Julian Hicks. His first reception of the day, gain of 15 in Central Michigan. Right. Offensive coordinator Chris Ostrovsky said that he is just untapped talent. Oh, Ford now takes a face full from Naquan Jones. Off the hip of Lazaro. To the air. Open. Caught. First down and almost to the 10 yard line for Cameron Cole. The junior from right here in Lansing. That's a gain of 16. First red zone trip of the day for the Chippewas. Off the shoulder fake. Lazaro lowers his shoulder and gets down to the 11-yard line. It's a gain of 10. Trying to get some of it back. Card for the Chippewas. Lazaro to the end zone. Cut. Touchdown. Central Michigan. Julian Hicks with his second touchdown of the season. The onside kick attempt. They may have gotten it. There's a pileup. The Chippewas think they have it. And they do. First down, Central Michigan. Last drive on third down. Lazaro. Almost stayed perfect. Nice breakup on the play by Kari Willis on the pass of Jennifer Sullivan. Then decided to come home. And he stays perfect on the season. Back-to-back -back score out of Cleva, Iowa. Headed off to Bridges. He's dropped for a loss on the play. Third down. Pressure. Oh, big sack. Robbie Stewart out of Saginaw, Michigan. And what you're seeing out of this Chippewa defense is these guys are not giving up at all in this football game. They run a little stunt. The big deep tackle comes out on the outside and no one's there to pick him up. Here's Hunt. It's over Sabal. And this is going the wrong way. Sabal trying to make something out of it. Gets out of bounds. Third down. Lazaro is going to be just short, about a yard shy of the first down marker. Simmons and Morrissey put the crunch on him. Worked down, going for it. 
Inside the 30. Logan Hesbrook. Option stuff. Mazzaro pitches it out to Ward. He wants to throw. Enzo. Polgin. Touchdown. Chippewas. 29 yards on the strike to the former starting quarterback, Tony Polgin. And here in his hometown, comes up with a score in the fourth quarter. Well, you get that same option look. You float up to the tailback. The tailback throws it to the backup quarterback. Tight end slash wide out. And the Chippewas going deep in their bag of tricks. Yep. Well, that's quite. The work he's back in the quarterback. Full throw, and it's caught. Just past the 20-yard line by Felton Davis. And pinned deep in their own territory. And now... Pocket closing. Pitches ahead to Hayward. Leaps over Freeman, and he's got a first down. Rushing the football. Several receptions. And Lewerke will take a knee here. As Michigan State will improve to three and one on the season and get their fourth straight win in this series over central michigan pretty good effort though by the chippewas as they'll head home for homecoming next week and then northwestern up next for the spartans thank